Well, we're, we're coming to the close of our third week, third city. Um, I feel like Camille and I have gotten really close. Um, as close as you can come with a person to whom you are contractually obligated to pretend to be friends with. Uh, she's a lovely woman, um, inside and out, mostly out. Um, inside, you know, she, what's great about Camille is she's good at everything. I mean, she's just so many talents, and she'll, and, uh, and sometimes she'll wonder, is Camille good at these things? And she'll let you know. That's what's great. She doesn't, she doesn't keep it inside. She lets you know, I am better than you, and uh, let me list the ways in which you are less than, and I am more than. It's nice to know where you stand with somebody. Sometimes you're like, how does this person feel about me? You always know with Camille, it's like, oh, I get it. You're awesome, and I'm a piece of crap, apparently. Um, so that's nice. Um, the other thing is, she smells great if you like nachos. That's pretty much it. Well, there was one time where I uh, had I pretended to make her hit herself with her hand, and I actually made her hit herself and drew blood. And it felt good. I'm not gonna lie to you. It felt real good. You know, we've spent a lot of time in the car together, and uh, I fantasize a lot about driving away from her. Like I'm in the car. She's like, where are you going? This is a dangerous neighborhood. And I'm like, see ya, wouldn't want to be ya. And then, uh, then never heard from again. I mean, I'm just gone. Puff, puff of dust.